The extended look here at the Monday forecast with Michelle. Well, Patrick, I think you're going to like the next few days. Dry skies, warmer than normal temperatures, and a little break from uh, stormy and damp conditions. And already seeing that on live pinpoint Doppler 12 radar this morning, where uh, we are dry if you're headed out, uh, still noticing roadways are wet and potholes may be filled with water this morning and disguised. Uh, so watch for that. Looking at our Narragansett beach camera, we have uh, good visibility down along the coastline. Still a little bit of fog up to the north. Uh, threat tracker, though, in the green for today, Tuesday and on Wednesday with a stretch of drier weather. Our temperatures this morning going to be running generally in the 30s. Looks like this data is missing, at least in some locations. Westerly 42 degrees feels like like 38 and we're going to be seeing those temperatures going from the upper 30s and lower 40s this morning into the low to mid 50s this afternoon. So low pressure that brought a half an inch to an inch of rain is moving out. High pressure to the west of us is building in watching some showers uh, off of the mid Atlantic and southeast US coastline. Those are a miss, but it may keep a little bit of extra cloud cover around just throughout uh, the first half of the day today. So here's a future cast showing those Partly to mostly sunny skies noon today and high cloud cover into the afternoon this evening and tonight, though, it's mostly clear and dry and it'll be a little bit cooler when you begin your day tomorrow morning. Not bad out there this morning. Uh, damp roadways, but dry skies temperatures in the upper 30s for the afternoon make it into the lower to mid 50s. This is showing uh, temperatures upper 40s to around 50 along the coastline. I'm thinking this is just a little bit too cool. I expect our temperatures to be just slightly warmer than this. So a nice day overall, about 50 in Seekonk, 51 in New Bedford, Fall River climbing into the lower 50s with clearing skies. This evening, mostly clear. Temperatures going from the mid 40s at 6 o'clock to the upper 30s at 11. And then later tonight, get a little bit colder. Other on either side at 30 degrees, cool and dry northwest winds at 5 miles per hour. We're quiet all the way through most of the day on Thursday, but watching a coastal storm that's going to take shape for the end of the week. And it's a slow moving ocean storm actually may get kind of trapped uh, in the waters to our south and east. So the track is going to determine the precipitation type and the extent of the impacts around here, but we could see a prolonged period of east and northeasterly winds with uh, astronomically high tides. That could be an issue for beach erosion as well as coastal flooding. And then we'll be watching for not only the potential for some strong winds, but possibly some rain and or some snow. So going to be a lot to iron out here at the end of the week. 54 degrees today, though 53 for your Tuesday under mostly sunny skies, looking like a beautiful day day to uh, maybe get outdoors Wednesday as well in the middle 50s and then Thursday increasing clouds chance for showers late in the day Friday's high in the lower to mid 40s but again that could change significant wind and precipitation possible coastal flooding and beach erosion a concern with this storm as well and again the track will determine the precipitation type your full future cast